Yeah. I'm Susan Eaton from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, yeah. and I'm a geologist and a geophysicist. And what I like about the glacier here is that we can I, see I where it was mm -hmm. 10,000 years ago, 20,000 years ago, by looking well, down in the valley and seeing the lateral moranes. So all these piles yesterday. of dirt and rock Seeing were deposited by the glacier yeah. when it was and miles thick. And today we're seeing what's left of the glacier because it's melting at a rapid rate. And glaciers tell us a lot about climate change. And the entire valley has been carved into a U-shape by a glacier which has since receded. And the remnants today we see in the till, the moraines, the lateral moraines, the terminal moraines, and the end moraines. It's very cool. Glaciology is very cool. <laughs> the glacier, you couldn't see the rock on the left. You couldn't see it um, when I first came down here. You couldn't see that one next to the little crevasse to the left. You couldn't see that at all. Mm -hmm. So do you think, why do we think it's receding? It's climate change. Climate change. It's, it's too warm. Air is warming. Well. The water's warming. And w warming water also ca causes precipitation and various other weather And patterns. not enough. Yeah. And, and not enough. Yeah. So you've so, been here four times and you yeah. say, think that it's changed over the those four years? Oh, no, I know. I mean, I've seen it. Yeah. You see it on a lot of the mountains that I've climbed repeatedly um, that used to have thousands and thousands of feet of glacier that I climb on now is just shrunk.